It's not every day you get to check on a museum on wheels. Well, in Mason City, folks are getting a chance to discover and learn about some perhaps less well-known chapters in our history. KIMT News 3's Alex Jurgens joins us live in Mason City at the Buseum's latest stop in our area. Alex, am I even pronouncing Buseum correctly? Uh, yes, you are, George. And inside this Buseum here, there are plenty of artifacts covering uh, different topics of history between World War I and World War II. Some overlooked chapters in our history, in fact. Now, uh, Hidden or Forbidden No More breaks down the period between World War I and World War II. Uh, exhibits are focused on chapters in history, including anti-German sentiment during World War I, the production of Templeton Rye uh, during Prohibition in Carroll County, Iowa, and the flu pandemic of 19. 18, just to name a few of them, Executive Director Michael Lewick Tram says visitors can learn from these exhibits to ensure that history does not repeat itself. These are exactly the stories that we have to talk about, even though we don't really want to, but we have to ask ourselves, why do these things keep repeating? Why do these dynamics not go away? And so we hope to, to offer some ideas about the answers, what they could be. Now, the bus is parked right behind River City Communications, just off 8th Street Southeast and South Federal Avenue. They'll, they'll be out here until 6 p.m. tonight, so if you're able to get off work and get over here and check out some history, you are able to do so. Now, after today, they will be heading to Decorah tomorrow, as well as La Crosse and Prairie du Chien, Wisconsin. Live in Mason City, Alex Jurgens, KIMT News 3. Thank you, Alex. Since its launch in 2003, the bus museum has traveled across the upper Midwest and each exhibit features some connection between Germany and the Midwest.